We got some gifts. We got some gifts. I know what Jake's is, but I don't know what this one is. Oh, it, what the hell, man? It says it on it. I'm excited about it. So that logo is really cool. I hope there's a sticker inside. We got a sticker table at the office now. It's a table full of stickers. Sticker? Thanks for all the entertainment while we were quarantined. Enjoy all your videos. Keep up the good work. And close is a little thank you. Hope you enjoy, Chad. I don't think that's the right voice. Thanks for all the entertainment while we were quarantined. It's more like that. Just huh? edit that out, please. Looks like they do candles and beer. Beer candles. Oh shit, that's cool. Unfortunately, we're gonna face it backwards until Pinstripe Pills partners with us. Yeah, what the hell? Partner with us already. So backwards smell. They talked about it. Ooh, that smells nice. It smells nice, like a dead crap. We should put the... All right, that'll be the bathroom. Thanks, Chad. Thank you, Chad, I appreciate that. 716 candles. Oh, boy. Oh, some memorabilia. How about that? Scorecard from 1976. I'll go read these forever. Oh, dude. Look at the ad. Mix nuts. Oh, my God. Look at the uh, dinosaurs on the back. Oh, my God. Is that an ad for something? Dino Land. 1960, the year my parents were born. Mm. Making love. Ooh, how about this? Snobbish? Canada Dry Canine Water? Never. It mixes with everything. I don't really get it. I don't I don't think. I think maybe I have to be from the 60s. <coughs> At that point you gotta be you gotta be born. This ad is for people born in 1940. Jim Coates hoped to duplicate his first half performance during the last half of the 1960 season. His first half performance during the last half. First half of the last half. So a quarter? They're taking what, a five game sample? A quarter. They're just the last half of the season, but his first half. Jim Coates. <laughs> God, wasn't that good. I can look at the stats though. RIP, great picture of Whitey Ford. And his article also opens up with a great line. It's like, bad first half because of a torn hip. That's what it says. You got a lot of, a lot of booze, a lot of cigarette ads. Booze? Oh shit. That was the this game. is a map to our office. That was the game you were born at. Our office is right where the hey. where the mar oh my I'll show God, you. Man. Look, yeah. our office is right where the marble is. Wow. Oh, a picture of the boys all touching hands, Joe D. Mm. Pre-COVID. Oh, this is cool. All right. So whoever sent us these, do we get a note or anything? Like they kept score. Yeah. So that means like someone. Someone kept score. It's like tangible history there. I like that stuff. To Jimmy, Jake, and the crew, enjoy these pieces of Yankee history. They belong to my dad and uncles. I'm a fairly recent patron and Blue Jays fan up in Rochester, so I obviously don't care for the Yankees. But you guys are simply good baseball fans. Wife and I love the morning show. Looking forward to its return. Bob Williams. It was very nice of you, Bob. And these are really cool. Thank so, you, Bob. I gotta go look up Jim Coates' first half of the second half of the season now. Looks good. Yankee stuff. We're back to talking baseball. We got free agents, new owners, and drama. Let's do it. It's the off season, guys. The season isn't on anymore. My name's Jimmy. Sitting next to me is Jake in California. We got tie dye ploof mm -hmm. and behind the dish producer Bug Bug. Dude, Jake, how are you doing? Tell us after Trev tells us how he's doing. Wow, it's a new year. I'm I'm first up, Jake. I watched the boys. Mm. Okay. Which is a TV show mm -hmm. about superheroes. I'm not a superhero guy, but this is like the anti-superhero thing, whatever. It's the craziest show I've ever seen in my life. I don't know if the chat's been on it. You guys been on it. 
Sounds like you've never watched a crazier show. Yeah. Insert Have you watched any show. of this? No, I haven't. I, I tweeted out the other day. I was like, you know, I'm ready for it. Who's got your free agent takes? Like, give me, you know, this guy's buddy is on the team or this owner didn't lose as much money because he's invested in Netflix or whatever. Like, give me, give me your free agent takes. And someone chimed in because everyone's like, oh, I want Bauer on my team. We're getting real mudo. And then someone from the top rope goes, you know, I really like Josh Reddick's fit on the White Sox. And I was like, yes, give me the 75th best free agent and where he's going. That's what I'm here for. So mm. I'm, uh, I'm tuned in right now. Wow. Yeah. We're going to go watch shows. We got green screen to make all the commenters happy. Oh, can you green screen something cool behind me? Maybe. Waterfall? Is that going to work? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't as easy as I thought it was going to be. Okay, okay. All right. We perfected the setup yesterday. And by perfected, I don't mean perfected, but we found something that might work. And it's sitting like this. Chairs need to be fully low. I'll do Jake's for him. He doesn't get to go on the ride. Waterfall. Waterfall. Watching baggage. God damn it, I'm stuck. All right. That's all. That's the setup. Oh, oh okay. Dog on set. That's a wrap. <laughs> oh, that oh man. <laughs> that dog has a lot of bad days. Don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good way to get yourself out of anything. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm just being silly. Yeah. Debbie. Some people love those. The, like, zebra cakes or something like that. Those aren't brownies. Little Debbie? Is that what it's called? The Cosmic Brownies. You'll know well, what I'm talking huge. about. That's these. Huge. I don't like these brownies. They're too dense for me. And those are basically had in one the commercial. I but those were... That's what's inside these M&M's. Those are basically the commercial. It's brownies like humping an M&M. I mean, we're only doing this show once a week now. Yeah. So do we just every halftime try a snack? I could try something. Lying to the people. That was dangerous. Because this is not closed. Almost fed. Almost fed BBD's pet mouse. Like 90%. It's closed. Heck, give the bag to Zach now. Yeah. And share with the people of the office. Zach, uh, try a brownie M&M. Leave the camera on. Show your hand eating it. Jim, Do a take okay. with your pants off. All right, off camera, Zach's reached in. Okay. He's eating it. Pants are still he's on. He's chewing. For some he's chewing. He's thinking. He's looking. Now it's he's definitely chewier confused. than I thought. It was chewier eating. than he thought. He says. That texture is surprising when you bite into an M M&M. and M. It's filling. It's I couldn't brown. tell if I thought it was going to be chewier or or less chewy. I, I don't know what I expected. Yeah, we'll see how long we go on it. Yeah. If we keep it to like exactly an hour, then I should have time to get everything going. Yeah. All right. We've recorded this last week, and it's an interview with Ryan Yarbrough of the Tampa Bay Rays. He was on with us in spring training, and we had him back. Fun to talk with a World Series participant. Um, I thought he was pretty insightful. That was cool to to pick his brain a little bit. And yes, we were teammates. Durham Bulls 2017. So basically, it was like interviewing one of my best friends. That was nice. Yeah, it was good. It was good seeing Trevor get his raise rocks off. That was fun. Uh, Yarby's the man. Uh, he's, he's a man that speaks to my soul a little bit when we we're talking about, you know, <laughs> he talked about like kind of zoning out and, and not paying attention when he's just chilling. I was like, yeah, live there, man. Music's playing. It's over. Was I early again? No, but you were like right on it. <laughs> it's gonna be kind of a tough cut. <laughs> uh. Love a good stretch. 
I just started recording, so okay. we missed the vloggy Jakey. Oh, vloggy stuff. Jakey! Vloggy Jakey! Yeah. Damn! <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys doing? Playing Tony Hawk. Uh, yeah. I don't know if I want this to be Chuck Tony. Again, I'm Tony. I'm gonna... Jake, what's Zach's game? I didn't get to watch him. Zach, from what I saw, plays his own game and not the game enough, if you know what I mean. Okay. It's a good analysis. How would you describe what I do? <laughs> yeah. School or horse. Go. Don't mind me, Zach. Yeah. Don't, Vloggy Jake. Don't mind the cameraman. It's, I'm on the other side of this. It's about angles. I don't usually get these angles, so this is good. Different. Jake's trying to tell you we want you on the ground more. Yeah. Make it Chomboy Media with the eye at the end. I don't know what I mean. Ooh, Benny Hanna. <laughs> well, I didn't mean to do it that anymore. He got the best. 600 points. Let's see what Zach gets. Oh, okay. Well, that was just... That was really bad. Zach. He fell at the end. Mm -hmm. Are you uh, goofy-footed in real life? I'm, I'm regular-footed. You don't have to answer that. No. Yeah, there you go. What, why won't it manual? I don't need to do a lot. I'm not gonna get too fancy. I tried to get too fancy last time. Oh boy, we've oh. got a situation. You hit the start button. So. What do I do? <laughs> I think you have it. Yeah, so you're fine. Okay. Oof. Classic matchup. There's a melon. Uh oh, okay. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, Zach. Uh -oh. You better get to that rail. Uh oh, you missed it. Yeah. And here I be. Ain't it funny? That's my money. Um, the there you king go. In New York. Nothing with all the muckety mucks. I'm blowing my dough and going deluxe. 39,000. Zach, are you intimidated by that round? I'm intimidated. Airwalk. Flat ground airwalk. You don't see it much in the real world. Oh! Zach, what the fuck? How'd you do a backflip? You know the specials? It's a combo. My 10 year old yeah. memory doesn't know the combos. Yeah. How am I going to beat you uh, without knowing a combo? Make I, a play. I was trying not to break out the combo. Would it be more interesting if you were getting the game? Are you pivoting to the game at all when we're getting the game? <laughs> You're good. I'm getting some of the shots, man. <laughs> they not seeing the actual... I have a very specific Get the, <laughs> Get the score. Because we're tied What? We what do you guys want to see? <laughs> were you I dropped my phone. We're both at jump. I was going back and forth. Oh, okay. It's called coverage? <laughs> How do I zoom, Zach? Turn this guy. Oh, wow. This is like a real camera. Okay. Oh, that, oh, that was weird. 60. 60 points. If I fall, yeah. I lose. I didn't catch where I wanted to catch. What? Whoa. Oh, we counted my score before the kiss rail. I mean, that's... That's, that's kind of... That's kind of... That's kinda, some bull... That's kind of tough. Zach's like, you got it, just end. <laughs> that's that's some tough. Not, I just got jobbed. Are we doing this again? If you pull out a fucking... Back, whoa! You can change grinds without jumping? There we go. That's bullshit. How am I going to beat that? You can do that. And with that attitude... Do you want me to tell you how to do the grind thing? Don't rub it in his face, Zach. Oh, no. Ooh. How do you do the grind thing? That's hard to do! It's hard. <laughs> Shit, I just lose. I lost! First competition in 10 years. What's the year, 2020? I'm coming for you. The specials was bullshit. <laughs> and you tricked me into losing. I didn't trick you into losing. It was As a joint I mean, effort between you, Tony Hawk himself, mm -hmm. the video game, and Jake. I Let me get some behind the scenes of Vloggy Jake. <laughs> <laughs> Show him your style. <laughs> My moves? I've been getting every angle. The low angles were really good. Yeah. You're going to like this shot. Mm -hmm. And there's Jim. Hello. The old upside down shot. Hello. You're going to have fun clipping this. <laughs> We've got an exclusive interview with Tony himself. Uh, but we left the camera zoomed in the whole time. <laughs> Tony, what do you think about this version of the game? Tony here. 
<laughs> um, <laughs> it's pretty good. We know it's Utah. <laughs>